Hey Collective, it's chatting with Chook and I'm back with another video. So I was like, okay, we can put on some energy and see what's going on with the Collective New Love, right? So then I seen, I seen one of my cards I got that says, stop face watching, you only hurting yourself. So right off rip, I got the message that somebody is like watching you OD trying to see what you got going on in your love life with this new with this new situation and it's like every time they watch something they just see something better coming coming for you in this person and spirit just tell them like yo just stop watching them because you only hurting yourself like let it go <laughs> so anyway we gonna get some energy on a new love let's see what the collective need to see tonight regarding their new love this person that's coming in this dope, dope, dope ass energy. Yeah, see, with this low key chiller and long car rides, I feel like you guys are going to spend a lot of time alone together. You know, very intimate, just getting to know one another. I don't feel like this connection is going to be one where um, a lot of people are in your business. Or a lot of things that's going on. Like, I feel like y'all going to get married and have a baby. And then people going to be like, I didn't even know y'all was together type shit. Like, it's it's only going to be when things are being celebrated in your life. That people are going to find out that y'all are a thing. But while y'all, you know, building y'all stability, building that foundation. It's going to be a, like, y'all going to be real low. Ain't gonna be no none of that. <laughs> and this ain't no this ain't no this ain't no Facebook relationship, okay? You got guy you doing things you ain't know how to do. Spend a night bag. Spend a night bag to dress that plus closet full. So with that card is like in deserving of this love. Okay. So with that card, I'm getting that. All right, we're going to start. But then have ha, got you doing things you ain't, you ain't know how to do. Like, I don't know why I'm getting, like, acrobats. So, I feel like this person really going to be flipping you and all sorts of shit. <laughs> okay, we're going to talk about it. This person, like, but it's like you may not have, even, like, known that you could do these things. Like, you might be like, um, damn, I didn't know I was flexible. Like, <laughs> y'all... The energy is spicy, but with this spending night bag to dress for, it's like y'all gonna be spending a lot of nights with each other, or like you know, like this is gonna be like oh, one weekend we spending the night at your house, next week weekend you're spending the night at my house. But I feel like eventually, like whoever y'all gonna start leaving y'all clothes by this person, like next thing you know, you got a drawer dresser, you done been damn near moved in type shit but i feel like you deserving of this love this is something that you are definitely deserving of and that's crazy I, I see business partners so that just lets me know like i said as far as your relationship goes it's gonna be very intimate very private like y'all gonna be creating money together all sorts of shit but it's not until you have a baby, you get engaged, y'all get married, that people are going to start knowing who you are. Like, oh, like knowing y'all a thing. Look, the sexual energy coming out again. Multiple positions. I'm telling you, this this motherfucker finna bend you up like a pretzel. Bend you all, bend you right up. Have your legs behind your head, all sorts of shit. Yeah, in love with you. I feel like you're not going to have to question anything when it comes to this person, love. Like, they are going to make it very clear that... I'm hearing, you're the only one I love. You know, the only one that I can trust. And if I ever should need you, I know you'll come. Ready to kill with a smoking gun, with a smoking gun. Mm -hmm. Yes, look. With this new union is protected and only one call away. Look, and then you got look. I love you already. But yeah, I feel like this person is gonna be very protective over you. 
that's crazy like it's really nothing you could like this you could call this person about anything i'm really feeling like you're gonna be like oh something wrong at work let me call my man oh oh they doing this oh they playing with me at the at the um wherever let me call my man no 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 hold on i'm gonna call my man real quick he gonna come handle this like yeah, you ain't got you listen hello like yeah like you not you not finna this person not finna play with you and it's like they're gonna reassure you like you could call me for anything like don't ever hesitate to pick up that phone and call me this person's gonna let you know you don't have to handle anything alone like i'm here for you new yeah so this is just confirming that this is definitely a new connection something you've never had before this is all new new energy let's get one more for the collective and then this new love yeah finally found someone who understands and then I see um a, have a lot in common. So I feel like, like I said, y'all both, and it's crazy because in love with you is in the middle of the, the spread. So that just lets me know that this feeling is very mutual. Y'all um y'all definitely are going to be in love with one another. You know what I'm saying? It's not going to be no one-sided shit. No, none of that. And like I said, this is somebody who you really, you're going to be able to call for anything no matter the situation this person is going to be here for you and i feel like this is something you deserve yeah they planning to come towards you you could be a water sign this person could be a water sign but i feel like they got a lot of love and emotion in their heart for you and you them I really keep hearing that song now, that Jasmine Sullivan, who that Jasmine Sullivan and um, Jada Kiss. And if I ever should need you, I know you can. Ready to kill, let us smoke again, let us smoke again. So, like, this connection is definitely it. Like, this is going to be one for the books. Let's get some more on collective new love. What do they need to see? What do the collective need to see regarding this new love? Baby, 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 baby. Don't you know that you're so Okay, she said, I think about you all the time. Wow. <laughs> yeah, so you could really think that this person look good as fuck. Like, if you got them on social media, it's like you could stare at their pictures all day or you that or them you. But I feel like y'all stay on each other's mind. And y'all think each other look good as fuck. Like it's like, damn. They 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 would look good next to me. Like I look good, they look good, we look good. Okay, so you got higher purpose and financially strapped here. I feel like you or this person, you guys don't care about finances. Like, you guys know clearly that you need money to survive. But at the end of the day, you guys know that it's a higher calling on your life. Yeah, with this slow, not ready. It's like, this person could be financially strapped and that's why they're not coming in. They could be trying to settle their finances. But I also feel like, like I said, this person is taking things slow. It's like they want to get things right for you. Yeah, it's like, would it fall in the reverse? I feel like this person doesn't want to have a family unless they know that they can provide for that family.
they not just gonna bring kids into the world and struggling they don't have the means to take care of this kid or nothing like that yeah i feel like this person is very like they take pride in what it is that they trying to do and like they're not gonna half step with anything yeah and with this independent card here is like this person is very independent like this is gonna be the type of person that they ain't gonna want you to work while you carrying a child they gonna want to be able to do everything for you do everything for the household do everything for that kid without feeling a burden financially and and that's why they want to take their time when it comes to you because they know what they want to give to their family they know what they want to give to you for some of you all you this like like i said this person could also be um financially strapped and, and their pride is not gonna let them come in because they see you as somebody who's um very independent and it's like they want to match your style i'm hearing we both wear gucci she matched my fly that's why i gotta keep her closer right by side to toast and a holster now she went low, so in case you didn't know, so you could save your money, dog. Shorty getting dosed, so but she care with his cause. You could call him Miss Boss. I got it backwards, crisscross. Shorty got her own. Yeah. This person know that you, like, you're Miss Independent, okay? Neo is coming through, but it's like... You don't need for nothing, okay? With this toxic, crazy in the reverse it's like you ain't for none of that shit and and this person ain't for that either okay you could have a toxic energy that wants to come towards you but they can't yeah with this emotionally intelligence i feel like y'all y'all both ain't got time for that toxic game playing cycles bullshit like y'all letting it both be known from rip like i'm not for that i went through that already i had enough of that in my life it's over somebody who know how to communicate speak on their emotions or what, what it is that they're feeling what they don't like what they love like this person is coming with all of that because i feel like that's what you are somebody who knows how to speak not sit there and be arguing yelling cursing you out and shit like that like it ain't gonna be none of that it's gonna be the type of person like bae you know can i talk to you express how i feel if you're upset you know we'll talk later let's give each other time to cool off like it's gonna be a lot of communication like this person this is this the type of person who if y'all get into an argument they not gonna storm out and be going for hours like they if they do leave they're gonna express that like babe i'm about to go wherever i'll be back like i'm gonna give us time to cool off this is somebody even if they do leave if you call them they're gonna pick up that phone they're never gonna have you second guessing like oh we got into an argument so they over there with this person this person is not with none of that you fuck around and think they somewhere they outside sitting on the steps or sitting in the car <laughs> they ain't go nowhere they just giving you that space because they know, yeah, look, you got distance coming out here. I also feel like this is going to be a connection where y'all might not move in together off rip. Y'all might stay at a distance, stay in separate homes and really just fuck with each other like that. Like I said, spending the night at one another's house. Get a few more messages with this new love. Yeah, you got a relationship. This could even be a long distance relationship for some of you all. But this is not going to be an energy where you're going to have to second guess. It's if y'all together or like because i'm hearing you my boo thing can't get enough i love your stuff let's turn it up you get what you want yeah you could have had situations where people just like you know oh that's my boo it ain't nothing 
real friends with benefits type shit. If this person is gonna jack their cheese. They definitely gonna claim what's theirs. They're not. They not. They not for none of that. Look, you got emotionally unavailable in marriage and proposal. Okay, so I'm not going to lie. Because it was been trying to come out. You know, the past energy is always going to try to resurface here and there. But I feel like this is somebody who was emotionally unavailable. They was not able to give you whatever it was that you was looking for. But some of you, well, you could have been in a relationship with this person, but it never went to the next step. Like, it never went to that marriage proposal type shit. It's like, they only, you was only stuck at this pregnancy. You could have had a baby with somebody, but it was like, it, it never went to where it was trying to go. But now you have somebody who's coming in who's emotionally stable, who knows what it is that they want. Like, their end goal is marriage, too. Their end goal is to get on one knee and propose to you. They not Like I said, they don't have time for none of the games and the bullshit. Yeah. Yeah, so you have somebody who is very immature. I'm telling you, this is the type of person who... Look, didn't I say they left you a fucking single parent? Like, this person was immature as fuck. And I feel like that's why that card fell out in the reverse. That, that, that family card. Because it's like whoever you was with, it was no family. It was, not, it was none of that. The shit was crazy. This person be yelling, arguing, veins, busting out they shit. They so pissed off. It's like you had to create some sort of distance between you and that person. You was like, this shit ain't good for me or my baby. It's out here yelling and, and carrying on. Shit was real complicated. This person, they they was, with this emotionally unavailable, this person, and with this immature coming out too, it's like this person, you would have never gotten there with that. This person could have been extra crazy, extra toxic. They could have had this, um, like, I own you type of energy when it came to you because you did have a baby bottom. But it's no more of that. You're like, oh, hell no. Me, whole time, this person ain't got no money. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you got somebody who, look, you got somebody who, let me baby. <laughs> You got somebody who is determined to come and bless you and yours with the finer things in life. It's like this person sees that you're a single mom, that you focusing on you and your and your child or your children, and 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 they 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 refuse to come in here half stepping. They refuse to come in here half stepping. This is somebody who definitely want to bring you bring you happiness. It's like if I can't come in and, and and give my all, give what it is that I want, I don't, I I I can't come in right now. And this why this yeah, because see with this with this with this friendship and commitment and then chemistry at the bottom of the deck, it's just like you and this person, like this person definitely wants to be your friend right now. It's like, but they know that they want to have a commitment with, with they want to have a commitment with you. Okay, the chemistry is definitely there. It's like this person refused to come in. I keep seeing water sign again. I'm telling you, you could be a water sign or this person could be a water sign. But it's like they refuse to come in and not give you and your child what it is that you deserve. Because you got the single parent out here. So it just let me know this person is not, they, 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 they not finna do that. It's like they know who you are. They know that. Like we can't we can't be doing that. Um what I wanna get. Let me pull some tarot. I don't never be pulling tarot on a new love, right? Let's get a few tarot messages. What else do they come? Oh that's why, cause every time I try to pull it be like spirit, you like, nah. <laughs> All right, but let's see what come out. What do the collect? Look, cut the deck on the Ace of Cups. Wow. I'm telling you, what's behind that Ace of Cups? Look, Ace of Cups. 
Knight of Pentacles, Justice. I'm telling you, somebody is waiting to get their finances in order before they come to you. And even, like I said, even if this person is not broke, they they have enough money for them. It's like they want to make sure that they good when they come in there for you. For real. With this Knight of Pentacles, y'all know that's the slowest move of the Knight of the Deck. But when they get there, it's there and it's stable. So it's like be patient. Continue to focus on yourself. Continue to elevate. Look. With the Empress, I just cut the deck on the Empress and the Queen of Pentacles. It's like continue to elevate, continue to grow. Because whatever it is that that you have been manifesting, the shit is coming in. You don't have nothing to worry about. Wow. That's good ass energy. So I'm going to leave it there. What's at the top of this deck? Look. <laughs> now the cups. <laughs> Nine of Cups, page of, page of Cups. So know that you got this person in their head, okay? You could be in this head, your head about this person. I feel like you and this person, y'all have a lot of happiness around y'all. Y'all gonna bring a lot of happiness to each other with this 10. With the, 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 the Page of Cups and the Nine of Cups is definitely the 10 of Cups. That's pure happiness. And I feel like y'all both have a good energy around y'all 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 be daydreaming about each other all day it's like y'all get shit done but this person y'all always in the back of each other's minds like you know like one day you see how they got these hands they like one day you know i know we're gonna be together this person really be in their head about you but it's like y'all y'all focus right now on what y'all got going on and y'all separate lives, y'all happiness, y'all stability, y'all peace. But it's like, you know this person, energetically, you know this person is coming in to give you this Ace of Cups. Or rip. So that is the message that I have for you all. And until next time.